Good everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix Xbox Party Chat is not working in your Windows machine. If Xbox Party Chat is not working in your Windows machine, here are a couple of steps which you could try to get this issue resolved. Now, the first step is to go ahead and check the microphone permission. To do this, you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on settings. Once you're on these settings, you will have to go ahead and click on privacy and security. Under privacy and security on the right hand side, you will have to go ahead and look for microphone. You can click on microphone and you will have to make sure the microphone access is enabled for your device and that the Xbox app. So please make sure the uh, microphone access is enabled right here. And at the same time, uh, you will have to make sure it is also enabled for your Xbox app or game bar app. So in case if it is not enabled, you will have to use this button and enable the microphone access to the respective apps. Once this is done, you may go ahead and close this window and then check if your Xbox party chat is working. In case if it works well and good, you don't need to try the next step. Now the next step is to go ahead and restart Xbox services. So the first thing what you will have to do is you will have to close all the Xbox app in case if you have any Xbox app running on your computer you will have to make sure it has been closed once this is done you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on run and in the run window you will have to go ahead and type services.msc you may click on ok this should open the services window once you have the services window you will have to go ahead and look for xbox live network service so it would be in alphabetical order so you can scroll down to the extreme bottom until you locate Xbox Live Network Services. Once you locate Xbox Live Networking Service, you can do a right click and then click on Properties. Make sure the service status is running. In case if it is not running, you will have to go ahead and click on Start. That would start the services. And also make sure the startup type is been set to automatic in case if it is set to manual or disable make sure it is been set to automatic click on apply and then click on ok once this is done another service what you will have to go ahead and locate for is ip helper again it would be in alphabetical order so once you locate ip helper you can do a right click and then click on properties make sure the service is running and also make sure the startup type is been set to automatic and at the same time what you could do is you can do a right click and then click on restart and then click on yes in case if you get a prompt so that will go ahead and restart the IP helper services once this is done you may close this window and then check if your Xbox party chat is working in case if your Xbox party chat is working well and good you don't need to try the next step now the next method is to go ahead and reset the Xbox app or game bar on your computer. Now when you're trying this step, make sure you have the Xbox app or game bar closed. Once you have closed the application, you may go ahead and search for Xbox app or game bar app. You can do a right click on Xbox app and then click on app settings. Once you're on the app settings, you will have to scroll down on this window and click on terminate so this will kill all the services associated with the xbox app once this is done you may go ahead and click on repair now while you're trying this step please make sure you have your credentials handy for your xbox account so there are chances that when you open xbox app or game bar app it might prompt you for the username and password so make sure you have those handy when you're trying this step so you will have to click on repair you will have to wait for a minute or maybe less than that depends depending on the speed of the computer once the repair is complete you will have to go ahead and click on reset and then click on reset again that will go ahead and reset your xbox app on your computer once the reset is complete you may close this window and then try to open the application and check if your xbox party chat is working in case if it is working well and good you don't need to try the next step in spite of trying all this step and if you're still facing a problem the next step what you could do is you can go ahead and update your audio drivers to do this you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on device manager 
just that should open the device manager on your computer once you have the device manager open you will have to go ahead and expand the audio input and outputs under this you will have to go ahead and update your drivers associated with your with your external device or with your speakers or microphone so in my case um, the realtek one is the default microphone driver you can do a right click and then click on update driver and at the same time you can also update the drivers for speakers by doing a right click update driver and search automatically for the drivers once this is done you may go ahead and close this window restart your computer and then check if your issue has been resolved now all this step should definitely resolve this problem in spite of trying all this step and if you are still facing a problem i would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that i can come up with the possible solution i hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day